Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to practically demonstrate few Selenium WebDriver commands. That is alert, get text, accept, and dismiss commands. So what is the purpose of these commands? Let me explain. For example, we have a web application. On this web application page, there is a button guys with the name click to get alert. When we click on this button, we are going to get an alert. Let me click. So when I clicked on this button, I got an alert like this. Now guys, if you got a requirement where you need to perform some operations on this alert using Selenium automation script, you need to perform some operation on this alert. For that guys, first we need to switch to this alert. We need to switch to this alert. For switching to this alert, you cannot directly perform operation on this alert guys. First thing is that we need to switch to the alert, then only we can perform operations. For switching to the alert, we have to use this command known as alert command. And after switching to this alert using the alert command, then let's say I want to perform some operation like I want to read this particular text uh, which is displayed on the alert. If I have to retrieve this particular text that is displayed on this alert, for that there is another command known as get text command. Using this get text command, we can retrieve the text that is displayed on the alert. Fine. Next thing is, let's say I want to accept the alert. That means I want to click OK on this alert. For that, we have the command known as accept. This will accept the alert. And last command is if you don't want to do any operation, simply you want to close the alert. For that, you need to use this dismiss command. Like this, there are several commands in Selenium WebDriver for switching to the alert and performing operations on the alert. Let me now practically show you how to use these commands one by one. So here already there is some Selenium sample automation code written for opening the Chrome browser. Right, this will open the Chrome browser. This will maximize the browser. This will open the application like this. This will open the application. Once the application URL is opened in the browser, now I want to I want to click on this button, guys, because without clicking this button, I will not get the alert. So I have to click on this button. For that, I will inspect this button. So there is some ID attribute value. Copy this ID attribute value of this button. Now here I'll write the code like driver dot find element by dot ID. I'll provide the ID and I'll simply say dot click. Now, once I say click, the button will be clicked. You see immediately when the button is clicked, we are going to get an alert. Now the thing here is we need to switch to this particular alert. Before I perform any operation on this alert, I need to first switch to this alert. So here I'll try to switch to the alert. How to switch to the alert driver dot switch to dot the command we have to use is alert command we have to use the alert command for switching to the alert driver dot switch to we need to provide this alert command this is the first command as per the current session i am going to explain this alert command right so how to use the alert command driver dot switch to alert command like this so this will switch to the alert but uh, the return type of this alert is alert so alert is equal to the return type of this alert is alert now using the object reference of this alert using the object reference of this alert after switch this will switch to the alert guys once you switch to the alert you can perform any operation on this alert let's say i want to retrieve this particular hello text that is displayed on this alert for that i'll use this object reference alert and say dot get text get text command of alert i'm using for retrieving the text from that is displayed on the alert the return type of this get text is string here so text on alert is equal to over the mouse on text on alert, say create local variable. The return type of get text will be added here. Now let's print this is text on alert. Now let's print what is stored in the text on alert variable like this. This, the retrieve text, which is retrieved by this get text command will be stored in text on alert. I'm printing the text on alert that will print the text that is displayed on the alert. Fine, once you print the text that is displayed on the alert, let's say I want to accept this alert. I want to select okay here. For that again, we have to use this uh, alert object reference and say dot accept command. We have to use this accept command. So far I explained three commands already. So in this list of four commands, I already explained three commands. First one is alert for switching to the alert, get text for retrieving the text from the alert. Third one is to accept the alert. That is selecting okay on this alert, alert dot accept. Now let me run this code to see whether these things are working or not, fine. So for that, let me run this code, right click run as Java application.
okay you see uh, it has selected alert came and it was very fast okay now let's see the output in the output hello text got printed this is the text that is displayed on the alert right the text that is displayed on the alert got retrieved using the get text and got printed here fine and uh, at the end it has accepted the alert also the alert got accepted you see you will not see the alert here because the script has accepted the alert once it got displayed now similarly similarly if you don't want to accept the alert if you want to dismiss the alert there is a command known as alert dot dismiss this will not select okay but it will not uh, it will not select okay it will actually dismiss the alert okay escape the alert kind of thing close the alert instead of accepting it will close the alert so for that let's run this and see whether the things are happening you will not see much difference guys alert dot accept alert dot dismiss you will not see any anything happening okay so we just need to use accept when you want to select okay button on the alert display alert you have to use dismiss when you want to simply close the alert without selecting okay so guys this is all about dismiss command so i covered all the four commands that is alert get text accept and dismiss commands hope you understood uh, all these four commands of selenium webdriver guys that's it guys thank you all bye